Title, Striking Screenwriters Gear Up to Return to Negotiation Table with Studios on Friday. TL, DR, after a 101-day strike, screenwriters will resume negotiations with major studios and streaming services this coming Friday. This work stoppage has surpassed the previous record set in 2007 to 2008 and has caused significant delays in the film and television industry. The guilds are addressing issues like compensation and the use of artificial intelligence. Meanwhile, actors also continue their strike with no immediate signs of negotiations resuming. The Writers Guild of America, WGA, has announced a fresh round of negotiations with studios and streaming services this coming Friday. These talks come after more than 100 days of striking, a situation that has caused considerable upheaval in the entertainment industry. What will the impact be on the entertainment world if an agreement is not reached soon? The strike began due to concerns raised by the writers, such as the use of small staffs or mini-rooms by streaming services. This practice has, according to the Guild, made it difficult for writers to earn a living income. They point to a significant increase in the number of writers working at minimum scale as evidence. But what is the right balance between writers' compensation and the studio's ability to control costs? The WGA members return to the bargaining table, they say, ready to make a fair deal, supported by the solidarity of their union allies. On the other hand, the Alliance of Motion Picture and Television Producers argues that meeting the writers' demands would necessitate paying staff even when there's no work. How can both parties find a middle ground that satisfies the demands of the writers without jeopardizing the sustainability of the studios? This strike has not only affected writers. Hollywood actors, represented by the Screen Actors Guild American Federation of Television and Radio Artists, have also been striking. Both unions have been on strike simultaneously for the first time since 1960, targeting better compensation and protection concerning the use of artificial intelligence in the industry. This joint action raises a larger question, how will the rise of artificial intelligence affect various professions in the entertainment field, and what regulations might be necessary to safeguard human jobs? The impact of the strike has been widespread, delaying many film and television productions, forcing talk shows into reruns, and even postponing the Emmy Awards. The last time writers went on strike, networks turned to reality television to fill their schedules. Now, the union has even shown readiness to represent reality show performers. Could this move be a significant step toward ensuring fair treatment across the industry? In conclusion, the resumption of negotiations between the striking screenwriters and studios this Friday is a crucial step towards resolving an issue that has rocked the entertainment world. Both sides are undoubtedly aware of the urgency to find a solution. As consumers of entertainment, how will this strike affect our viewing habits, and what might the long-term consequences be for the industry? Is this a turning point for how talent is treated in the era of streaming services? First seen at mimotherload.com.